hello people right i've had a few people asking me if there's any um difference with the uh picture settings if they're better or not um now i couldn't really tell you that if they're better because i don't use uh standard settings because i did find i didn't find it very crisp the actual um sorry about the flickering that's just the camera um I didn't find it particularly brilliant picture when I first got the TV there was nothing spectacular so let's go down to settings and then you go down to your picture and sound modes um, viewing mode um, is that new oh no right what you need to do first auto backlight adjustment you need to turn that off um, what I've done with my backlight is right up to 80% because I believe in auto. Let's have a look. Oh, I didn't tell you. Right, let me just turn that back off. Um, it's quite low because obviously the TV, most TVs these days ship um, with the uh, most economical settings they can do. I think that's a law thing. So here we go. These are my picture settings. I've got 80% on the backlight because anything over 80% is a bit too bright for my eyes. Aspect, aspect ratio, just have it on auto, it's select what it needs to. Um, HDR, I prefer it bright, but you might prefer it dark. So it's uh, entirely up to you how, how you like your picture. Everyone's going to be different. And the same I've done on Dolby Vision. Now, I think it looks absolutely fantastic when watching HDR, Dolby Vision, whatever it is, blah, blah, blah. Um, uh, it, it just works for me. And the auto UHD and HD is uh, on, yeah, it's on auto. Configure custom settings. I think this is just the tint and stuff. So contrast 49, I think I did bring that down. Sharpness, you turn that off because otherwise the... Um, TV the software will over sharpen the picture instead of using the natural picture that was designed to come through whatever program you're watching so it does not need to be on uh, up high because otherwise you end up getting uh, things that just look nasty they just look horrible they won't look real it, it just will not look right at all so I stuck that right down to zero you might want a bit of extra um sharpness but i i don't think you need it at all especially when you've got an ultra hd that i mean that is crisp crisp as hell um this seems to be different i've not noticed the white balance before um okay i'm going to leave that for the moment and color space red green right okay so that has changed it never used to be in an option like this so you've got the lumens, lumen, yes, that bit at the bottom it <laughs> anyway. Um, okay, so you can choose which, right, it's not just red, green, blue now. You've got yellow, cyan and magenta. So that's pretty cool. Let's have a look at the white balance. Okay, so yes, this is, this, I don't believe I've seen this on here before. Uh, not something I kind of muck around with, it's fine as it is. Uh, local dimming. Bear with me. Let me have a read of this because I don't remember this being on or even being here. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes more sense. Yeah, so you sort of, that is something you want on to make the black still look black. But if you're one of these people that are moaning that the blacks are too black, you're probably going to want to turn that off because then you'll get the backlight lighting up the black pixels but for me i think the blacks look absolutely fine but that might be my eyes you know absolutely fine with my eyes if your eyes don't like it or you don't like that the way it looks change it it's not going to hurt you just change it to the way that you like the picture everyone's going to have different ways and different ways they set their telly up i like a nice bright vibrant picture um and with ultra hd yeah i i like to see the colors so that is it that's all you sort of need to know about how to set up your um actually did i miss one let me just have a quick look viewing mode picture and sound give me a second picture did i go into that yes i did 
viewing mode yeah viewing modes on custom it automatically go into that when you start mucking about with the settings um, yeah that's what I do that's how I've got my TV set up and that works fantastically for me um, thank you very much for watching again please like and subscribe I'll do your thumbs up hang on <laughs> can you see my hands there we go